welcome to this video. Very happy to see you again. After installing the receiver and learning how to connect the motor to the electronic speed controller and how to connect the electronic speed controller to the flight control board, here in this episode we will make the final assembly and here we will learn how to find the wells and how to install the dumping spoon tools. And after that, you can fly the sound phone directly to 50. So are you excited? Okay, let's start our assembly. First, use a nylon zip tie to bind the connecting lines with the arm. And use other zip ties to bind the connecting lines with other arms. Bind the UBEC and a right arm with a nylon zip tie. Turn over the frame. Cut off the usually steep ties. And insert a zip tie in the skid sliding dumping sponge too and bind underneath the arm to protect the frame. Bind other skid sliding dumping sponge tubes underneath other arms in the same way. of the easily zip ties. Use a nylon zip tie to bind the connecting lines of the receiver firmly. and couch of the usually same time.
measure the length of the battery with a velcro tape and cut the velcro tape into two pieces. And then cut another one into two pieces. Place a vacuum tape on the bottom board. And another one on the battery. Insert the battery into the middle parts of the upper board and the bottom board. Use the right binding stripe to bind the battery. Use a nylon zip tie to bind the baby bone battery indicator and the white arm close to the charging line of the battery.
Then insert the pins on the BB bone battery indicator into the pin sockets of the charging line interface of the battery. Pay attention to insert the pin sockets of the charging line interface of the battery corresponding to the leftmost black power line to the cathode pin on the BB bone battery indicator. The pin socket corresponding to another black power line next to the leftmost one into the 1S pin and the pin socket corresponding to the third black valve next to the right valve to 2S pin. Finally, insert the pin socket corresponding to the right power line into the 3S pin on the BB bone battery indicator. Cut of the usually steep tie. Next, we are going to install the propellers onto the motors. First, disassemble the four bullets on the motors. And then install a counterclockwise propeller on the number two motor. Install a clockwise propeller on the number one motor. And the other counterclockwise propeller on the number four motor. And another clockwise propeller on the number 3 motor. By now we have finished all the soldering and the installing. Now go to enjoy the fun of flying the sound founder to 250.